The overall goal of this procedure is to prepare mouse brain tissue for immunoelectron microscopy. This is accomplished by first fixing the brain through perfusion of the animal. The second step of the procedure is to cut the brain and process the sections for immunohistochemistry. The third step of the procedure is to osmocate, dehydrate, and embed the sections. The final step of the procedure is to cut ultra-thin sections. Ultimately, results can be obtained that show, at high spatial resolution, the distribution of various proteins within different regions and cell types of the central nervous system. Hi, I'm Marie-Ève Tremblay from the laboratory of Anya Majeska in the Department of Neurobiology and Anatomy at the University of Rochester. Today we will show you a procedure for preparation of mouse brain tissue for immunoelectron microscopy. We use this procedure in our laboratory to study interactions between microglia and synapses during development, experience-dependent plasticity, and aging. So let's get started. After fixing the mouse brain through intracardiac perfusion, post-fix it in approximately 10 milliliters of formaldehyde at 4 degrees Celsius for 2 hours. Wash the brain in 4 degrees Celsius 1x PBS 3 times for 10 minutes each wash. Using a vibratome and ice-cold 1x PBS, immediately slice the brain in transverse 50 micron sections. Use a fine brush to transfer selected sections to a glass vial filled with 4 degrees Celsius 1x PBS. Store remaining sections in cryoprotectant at minus 20 degrees Celsius for up to several years without alteration. Process a maximum of 10 freely